Let's Play Colonization starts as soon as I reheat this Hot Pocket. It's only been under my bed for a week. Welcome back gamers, this is SKS for Let's Play Colonization. The last time we left off, it was end of turn. But it's not now, because we're going to hit this button and it's going to cycle through. And we're going to figure out what needs to happen. I've got a boat coming around. Oh, there's a couple of privateers there, just waiting to plunder me it seems like. This will probably be the last video I do tonight, so I can actually get some rest, and I've been playing Gasp, dare I say it, my Xbox 360, I've been playing some Assassin's Creed 2, catching up on that. Yeah, I buy games, and then I just play them when it snows and we're out of school, so when I can't teach, I play games. Sounds like the life, doesn't it? Well, go to college, get your degree, teach high school, and you'll be like that. Alright, so one of our privateers has finished repairs. Uh, spam has run out of lumber. That is not good because we cannot produce a lot of lumber. Um, so I will put this guy here producing four lumber. So we need to actually buy some more lumber and take it to spam. If I have a ship that's ready. Uh, cathedral, 55 tools. I've already made them make tools. And they're making tools there. They should have that done. A new cargo of coats. We need to sell all those. I'm sitting here going cross-eyed looking at this game sometimes. Alright, we've made our way... Oh, we wouldn't let me talk to him. But I went back to Newcastle Brown Ale, the one and only, imported from England. Good beer to have. I'm going to take my privateer here and just wait for that guy to get done talking to them. I don't want to get it attacked and lose yet another privateer. Ah, the taste. The taste that brings you luck. I should totally do commercials. No, I hope that everybody's been uh, watching other LPs that people have been working on. I know that uh, on my channel I have a couple of LPs or Let's Players, just people that I enjoy watching. Uh, don't pay attention to my subscriptions because I watch a lot of different garbage on the YouTube and we all know that YouTube's full of garbage, but over there I have a little title called LPers that I want to have my baby. And uh, those are the ones who I really enjoy watching. Uh, most of them are PC players. Some of them, though, do do Nintendo games and other things. So if you're into watching LPs of all sorts, check those out. If you'd like to be listed on there, let me know. Send me an email and give me a heads up. Uh, I'll come check your stuff out. Because I know that I try to watch as much as I can, but there's so much going on in the Voltron Army forums. Again, go check them out. Google search them. Go to the website. It's posted in my my links most of the time. Uh, go check them out. Donate to them. Those guys are really doing a good job, and we need to keep backing them up. So we wait for this turn to roll. I, I really don't know what all to talk about during the turns. We're going to talk about the price cloth. Talk about the sun coming up. The cathedral, 55 tools, that don't seem like they're making... Oh, we're not making tools here. Do I feel stupid? Okay, we had tons of ore. I remember taking the ore up there, but we just didn't start making tools. So, silly me, I'm an idiot. So we'll get that closer, and then we'll probably pay for that. And Fort Boob has completed the ironworks. And they have a new cargo of lumber. Maybe we need to take that over to uh, Spam. Alright, so the ironworks there will be excellent. We can produce it up for the 50 tools a turn, gamers. 50 tools. We're going to build the custom house. So we're going to leave him making tools, and I need to get these other guys here. Well, if the game will let me. No, stop it! I don't want you really to mine for ore, because we have a ton of that. I don't want you to make guns. There we go. There we go. Actually, yeah, we'll let you make tools. Yeah, that's looking good. So we'll build the custom house. I'm excited to see what that will bring. Depending on how many episodes that I get uh, recorded in the next couple of days, I might go two a day to get these up on the internet, and I might just keep one a day. It just depends, really. $360 worth of beads. That, that'll work out nicely. Puts us up close to the 2000 range. 
I know some people have been leaving comments that they've been finding uh, fountains of youth. Well, you all can just kiss my butt because I've not found crap on this game when it comes to certain stuff. Let's take these coats. We're going to take this 84 silver. And that should be good enough for that merchant man. And we will head back to England and sell that. And I do recall somebody having a lot of lumber. So we're going to take a hundred of this lumber. And we're actually going to... You need to go to I Hate France. And we're going to take this stuff down here and send the 100 lumber to spam. Those silly Dutch, look at them. They always got dragoons everywhere. Let's establish a mission. The Iroquois react with hostility. What? Of course, establishing a church in 666, 1666, is probably not the best idea. But... They'll just have to calm down. So let's see, how many people do we get guarding the gate here? None, so... Alright, let's take this lumber. And we're going to unload it here. Yes, we're going to unload it. You'll have to deal with it. And we will take 200 more loads of lumber. 200 more loads of lumber. And put it on that frigate. What a frigate. We will fortify you there, good sir, on I Hate France. And we let the turn turn. That's redundant as you can get. The turn turn. The more, I know that some people ask to uncover all the map, but the more map you uncover, the longer it takes for the turns to go by. Master Tobacconist, I'm going to get him just so I can turn him into something else. And all right, another colonist has learned to be a soldier. Excellent. And a new cargo of lumber, that's always good to see that. How much is it to finish this copy? Oh, we'll, we'll finish that then. And you see all these free colonists are learning to be soldiers, so that way when we have to arm them, they'll be ready to go. Which I am going to have to start producing more guns here soon. And population increase in Fort Boob. Alright, so we have one more guy out here. What should we put him to work doing? Well, I'm going to put him over here. We'll put this guy back getting ore and you can actually practice to be a hammer maker so, so we need to get that custom house going new cargo of furs, we'll probably have to ship them up north and this is your play by play, this is your announcer SKS bringing you all the hits of the 90's and 80's yeah don't ask what that was. I told you gamers, I'm going crazy. Let's go over here and make landfall. Oh, he's not going to do it. He's out of turns. Maybe next time he'll actually land. Alright, this privateer here. Privateer here! I'm going to unload. Probably spoil. Oh, no. Yeah, well, if we lose two furs, big deal. I'm not really worried about that. Here, we'll make you happy. We'll load them in the wagon train. I think I just lost a hundred furs somehow. Yeah, that's that's not what I wanted to do. All right. So we're gonna send them back down here to plunder the French. Getting happy, my team on TV playing basketball is starting to win again. They're not playing like ass. My beer's tasting good. 
things are starting to look up, and I know as soon as I say that, gamers, you know something's going to happen. So let's take these furs up here to new porn. Just leave that guy right there. Alright, spam has some new people. First we need to take this guy off. We're just going to put him right there as a colonist. Let's make a lumberjack here so he can actually... No, stop it. Stop it. This one. There you go. He can make some more lumber. And, uh, let's see. Spacing these out. We're a little short on food. I don't know why he's only making two food out there. It doesn't make sense to me. Let's see. Can we make food here? All right, we're only two short. That will last for a little while, but not really a long enough time. I I don't know, gamers. Let's let's put him up here making Liberty Bells. If we can actually get that bonus, that plus one will take care of that. So let's hope for that. Let's load up this tobacco and sugar cane. I always thought sugar looked like cactuses on this game. Oh well, Sid Meier got most of it right. Sorry he doesn't know what a... Uh... So we'll send this forget to spam. Give them some much needed lumber. Maybe I should have loaded them up with some food too. Had them sail west. There is a galleon, a French galleon. Wow, that's a rarity. Uh, I never even thought to build one of those. I probably could have, but I don't think they have much attack. We'll look at the Colonizopedia con <laughs> here in a minute. Or whatever you want to call it. And we'll see what they have. Ooh, there comes some goodies right there. If I can attack them. All right, and Fort Red has produced a cathedral. Let's hear some music. Oh, I didn't play it. The one guy's producing 18. I wish you could upgrade your town hall. I really do. That would just be pretty neat. Uh, we can actually build a university, a shipyard, an arsenal. Let's go ahead and do an ironworks here. And then I'll probably start producing uh, some more artillery. Uh and start spreading that around. So 32, yeah, that looks good there at Fort Red. And Bartolomeu de la Casas has joined the Continental Congress. Bartolome, what a great name. That's just so cool. And the game, there we go. Let's go, come on. All right, he's hiding back there in the back. He's got a robe on. Uh, all current existing Indian converts are assimilated into the colonies of free colonists. Yay! So, uh, we can go to different places, and I'll show you what happened. Let's check out what we have now. Jacob Fuger, uh, boycotts and effective. We might do that one. God, I wish George Washington would pop up there. John Paul Jones, I might actually do him. We've looked at most of these before, gamers. Uh, Pocahontas keeps them, uh... I don't know, Fernand Magellan sounds like a good one, but I, I think I want to do John Paul Jones so that it will empty him out and George Washington will have to pop up there next time so we'll go with that one I know you all won't agree with it uh, if you want to yell at me in the comments feel free to do so I'll probably just not pay attention to you but we'll see what happens so let's go to London England with them let's unload this dude Let's have you go over here and see if we can plunder the French on this side. I like to sink their galleon. Yeah. Still, I'm awaiting comments of games you'd like to see me uh, take on in the future. Like I said, I have this natural southeastern Kentucky accent. I'm sure that it could 
equivocate wonderful values of noise for different video games. So just let me know. Let's go up here to unit types and we will check out a galleon. Uh, move 6 cargo combat 10 but not armed. So there you go. That's, that's what I thought. It cannot attack. Uh, what we're going to have to worry about is these. These Man of Wars, Combat 24. Powerful vessels appear when the War of Independence develops. Uh, your mother country will send them against your forces, and if foreign intervention occurs, you'll receive some support to your cause. Uh, they are heavily armed with cannon and capable of carrying large invasion forces or cargoes. So, like, the only thing you have is frigates, and their combat of 16. So you have to... It's, it's iffy. You want to kind of have some frigates out there. Uh just to protect your water some. Alright, let's go over here. Hopefully we can get some guns, horses. Or we could get sunk! Oh. Did you see that? I saw that. The sailors on that boat really saw that. Oh my god. Oh my god, and that was sunk too, wasn't it? I'm losing my naval power bad, folks. I've got to make some money soon. I've got to find something to make some money. Oh, Lord. I just... I don't even know. Send these guys back. I didn't want to leave that screen, but I forgot it automatically makes you. Yes, yes, yes. I know you gotta have food for the winter months. I'll have somebody walk outside the colony if they have to. Why don't the Indians give you food? Um, let me view European status. Here's what I say to this. Let's check this out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, here we go, folks. Your expedition happens upon strange burial mounds. Let's search for treasure. Yes! Finally! Within you find incredible treasure. Worth 3,000 gold. It will take a galleon to get this treasure back to Europe. It's sad we don't own a galleon. So I really don't know what I'm going to do. I can't just instantly make one of those. Um, I really, I'm going to have to think about this. Uh, do I want to invest in a galleon here soon, or, I wish you could capture from other, I don't know, folks. I don't know. I need to keep this away from the Indians. Though I don't think they'll attack me for it. See, this is where you should plan ahead, but where I've not got anything, it's, uh... I've not really hit any of the jackpots ever on any of the other searching for treasures. So, I mean, I never invested in a galleon. It just wasn't on the top of my order. So, if you earn, learn one thing from me, have a galleon just in case so you can transfer treasure back. I mean... I, 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 I don't know. Yes, yes, I know we need to produce more food, but, uh, I don't know if we could produce more food anywhere. Oh, he could produce food, two food right there, so we're good, we're set. Uh, let's unload that wood. Can you make wood there, sir? Yes, you can make four food. So we'll actually build up our stocks of food over the next few turns and, uh, see what happens. So that worked out nicely. And a new cargo of tools, or a new, yeah, a new cargo of tools. I don't know what I was thinking. New porn up to 70%. New citizens keep that down just a little. 
I still need to work these fortresses along. I need to check I Hate France to see how they're doing. Let's uh, let's talk with the chief. 192 gold. Yeah, that, that's great. Especially this 3,000 we just plundered from your all's ass. Go over here and check the French out. A little stockade action going on there. Yes, yes. I didn't want to trade with you. I hit the wrong button. Just deal with it. Hopefully I can come down here and cut this uh, galleon off. I do need to purchase my own galleon. I could use that 3,000. Let's go to I Hate France. My wish list is growing bigger and bigger. It's not a good thing, but uh, I, I really don't know what else to do, gamers. And there goes that galleon. I bet I missed him. Shoot. There's one down there I can go after. Hopefully good things will come from that. Well, the French are really coming up with some military power. I don't... You'd think they'd realize that their uh, their home country of France sucks at fighting in wars, and they'd only need a couple of guys. I don't know why they're putting in so many. But I know that they're a lot farther behind me in getting ready to declare independence, so... I don't have to really worry about that. And we have an ironworks and a new cargo of coats. Excellent. I'm pretty sure I can't unload all this. So what do we need to build now? A magazine, a dry dock. Let's build a magazine because when we start building guns, we're going to want to build a lot of guns. Okay, they're heading to England. These boats are taking the worst possible path to go back to their home country. I really don't understand them sometimes. Alright. Need to send him over there to pick up our scout. Now, I know they had a merchant man over there. He probably fled. Oh yeah, we have a colony, and let's see, who needs a guy to defend their walls? Looks like they do here. So we'll send you to Fort Red. Bum, 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 bum. What's your specialty here? Can we get you a... Let's see, what will you become? A ma yeah, Master Farmer. Why didn't I take advantage of that before? I feel stupid. Let's, let's move you up here. Since I paid good money for you, you better go make me some money. treasure galleon up here and hopefully hide it from everybody else in existence. So my goal now is to save up to buy a galleon, which I think they're 5,000. Look at all the dragoons of France. Man, they're just ready for war. Glad they're away from me. Price of cloth, blah blah blah, crap we don't care about. Spam is gaining liberty. A colonist from Fort Red has learned to be a soldier. That's what we like to see. That's what we want. There's nothing here really they can sell. We'll take these 20 coats down. Okay, a fortress. We are very close to having that finished. Yeah, I'm not going to spend a thousand, so uh, you three stooges need to go over here and make tools. Sixteen, and we'll make...
make 24 a turn. That one will take a couple of turns to finish that. New cargo. Let's go talk to these guys, speak with the chief. Break the game. Season scouts. I am a season scout. All right, at least they're giving us money down here on these islands. But we're going to stop there, gamers. We've reached the end of our time. I've actually ran over what I usually like to do. I hope I don't bore you to death when I keep them going so long. But keep in mind what you want to see, and uh, give me a shout-out of what you want to see me do on this game. Uh, but we'll see you next time. This is SKS for Let's Play Colonization. You all have a good night now.